Howdy. Today we're going to make a mellow trap beat, something you could hear Post Malone, Young Bands, or even All Day On, among many others. I think the key to making a good chill beat is being very minimal. You don't want a lot of sounds cluttering things up because the vocals are going to be what's carrying the song, not the beat. To start out, I used Serum to make a simple sine wave synth. All I did to make it was use one oscillator with a sine wave. I used envelope one to make it sound like it's quickly starting over each time the chord is played. Lastly, and quite frankly the most important part, is I enabled Portamento by ticking the always button in the Portamento section. I laid out a lush chord progression to give it a sort of R&B feel. Seeing as the synth is a little heavy on the low end, I made sure to cut a lot of it out so that the other sounds have room to breathe down there. One of my favorite parts of this beat is the main lead I used throughout. I used the Serum preset Bottle Blower and just laid out an extremely simple melody. I gave it two separate reverbs for a super reverb and possibly not even the same The first sound used in the verse is a preset in Serum called Mute Bass Guitar. I gave it a slight reverb since it was the only instrument other than the drums at first. And I also cut the low end out since I'll have a sub running at the same time. I changed up the pattern throughout the song depending on what part we're at. For the verses I kept it simple. Then the first bridge it gets ramped up a little bit. Finally, the chorus is essentially the same as the bridge, just with some parts cut out. I'm also using the Castle Lights preset in Celestia, a contact library, for this shimmering sound to lay over the verses. For the first bridge and chorus, I'm using an 80s lead made in Massive at a really low octave to follow along with the chords. During the first chorus, I used the same chord progression as the intro, but I cut it up a little bit to give it a little bit of breathing room, and I also followed it with a Celestia preset solo viola love. Last but not least, for the second bridge, I decided to change things up a bit and throw in a smooth pipe harp from Celestia to keep the beat since we don't actually have any drums during this part. I mainly use sounds from a random trap pack I found on the internet. I feel like I focus heavily on the hats more than anything else. It also might be worth noting I used a rim hit instead of a classic snare or clap for most parts. For the bass, I used a big white Beats 808. It was in the key B, so I made sure to change the root note. I also dropped all of the envelope filters all the way down except for the decay so that it was just a short punch of bass. I also have an alternate version that isn't just a short punch that I used for the chorus. The only thing that is different here is that the decay is down and the hold is all the way up. Here's the final product.